Hello, ladies and gentlemen. It is July the 11th, 2024. Yesterday when I mowed the lawn, I was talking about the khaki weed. That it was uh, still a lot of it out there, even though we really sprayed our yard with 41% glyphosate. Well, my wife wanted to get out there today, so, okay, all right. So I said, go ahead, and uh, she went out there, and she's already gone through about four or five gallons or six gallons and has gone out there and really sprayed big time. And now she's going down the alley back out that way tw towards the street because that whole area back there is just infested with khaki weed. And what happens is my neighbor right over that way, he gets out and he likes to mow the alley too and he'll get those, the stickers from that khaki weed in his lawnmower tires and spread it because I've had all this whole area right over there. I had it all killed off and <laughs> well, it come back. <laughs> so we're gonna try to get all the khaki weed from the street all the way back down through, through, through there. Killed off and we'll just see what happens. But it's something we gotta stay on top of. That khaki weed gets stickers in it. If y'all don't know what khaki weed is, and and the stickers will get in your shoes. And then you gotta take your shoes off before you go into the house or it will get into your carpet. Then you'll step on them when you're barefooted and they're just little bitty stickers. But they, they're a pain in the wazoo. Years and years ago, I used not to have it. I don't know where it come from, but it, it come in off of somebody's tires on their lawnmower or their vehicle or, or something like that. But then I didn't know what the stuff was. You know, I thought it'd be easy to kill, but boy, it's, man, it's not. But that is a, a very invasive weed. And, it's, and and I think it's not only prevalent here in the U.S., but in other countries, too. I don't know if it has another name other than khaki weed, but that's what we call it over here, is khaki weed. Or at least in north central Texas. Because, you know, when we take the trash out from here around to the front yard to for the trash people to pick up man the shoes would just be covered in that khaki weed then you, you got to, you know got to take the shoes off before you go in the house you got to but then when you scrape your shoes you know like these sandals here you you know I have to get my pocket knife and scrape it man to get all them burrs off of it another pain in the wazoo but my crazy wife, she, she's out there and and spraying, and I, I told her to be careful that you want the wind to your back and don't spray into the wind. You know, you want that stuff blowing away. It, it's not calm, but, but the wind's not blowing much either. It's, it's very, very light. But I just want her to be careful because uh, I can't live without her. I mean, she's the greatest thing God ever gave me. All right, y'all take care.